Hello, my name is Stephen Carr and I'd like to welcome you to another AutoCAD cooking class. In this session we're going to be looking at creating a 3D bowl, 3D pitcher, 3D uh, hanging lamp and a 3D wall lamp. I'm going to start off with the 3D bowl. Um, we need to have some layers here so I just have a bowl layer which will be fine. This is important because we're going to attach material by layer and then all the bowls will get the material attached to them. So that should work out pretty good. So I'm just going to work in layer 0 and just change it over. So first thing I want to do is I want to go to my I've set my screen up here with my three views I've set my units, set my limits. So I'm just going to click in my front view and I'm just going to draw a line from 0 comma 0 and with my ortho on I'm just going to go up in the y direction 12 inches and that should be fine and then I'm also going to just create I want to create a uh, 12 inch diameter bowl so to make my construction a little bit easier I'm just going to create a rectangle again in the front view starting at 0 comma 0 and I'm just going to go to 6 comma 6 and that gives me my simple construction here so we know that if I do an arc it's going to be somewhere along here in this area here. So um, I'm going to do this with a P line. So I'll start with the P line and most bowls have a, a bit of a flat base on them. So I'll just come across here to about here. And then one of my options in P line is arc. So I can go A for arc. And I'm just going to go up to this corner here and then hit enter. So I'm just going to click in here and just move this in just a little bit turn my ortho off so I can have the shape will sort of fit in my bowl so that's pretty much the construction I can erase my rectangle now and um, if you want this is fine for what we're doing here but if you're really really concerned about a bowl a bowl has a thickness so we should be able to offset this and we could set it off, offset it by a sixteenth of an inch. And then I'm just going to draw an arc. Draw an arc from here. And just again, just close is okay, but it doesn't have to be perfect. Then I'm just going to P edit and I'm going to join these two objects. So now uh, zoom extents. Zoom extents. And this is our bowl. Everything is set up. It, this is uh, one object, which is good. I don't have to. Uh, do a closed polyline for this. So if I go to uh, my modeling, we can do the revolved uh, creation. So when I click on revolve, it says select object to revolve. So I click on my polyline for the bowl shape and then enter. And then um, I'm just going to do object for my revolve it. So I click on this line here and of course it wants to know how much to revolve it so 360 which is the default so I just hit enter and then basically uh, my construction is done here so I can if I zoom extents here zoom extents here and I'm in here so I can just click on this and change this go into my layers change this to my bowl layer which is good and uh, there's no I don't think there's any extra construction in here if I was to uh, turn off my freeze my bull layer there's no extra construction so that's fine so we're just fine now so I think everything is cool we just have to save our file So again, um, our product is basically finished. We've done the bowl, but if you look in the assignment, you'll see that we have a, 
an 18 inch radius or 36 inch diameter bowl and we have an 8 inch diameter bowl. You don't have to create a new one. Um, all you have to do is insert it, um, copy it, give it a scale factor of 3. So 12, 3 times 12 is 36. Or you can give, uh, again, insert it, uh, give it a scale factor of 0.66. So a third, two thirds of 12 inches, 8 inch. So one bowl becomes three bowls. You don't have to do any other work. So enjoy and see you soon.